What is going on everybody? It is Fitz Miller and the Skyline back here with another video. Episode 4, Sunday the Show Day. Without further ado, let's get right into today's video. Well, who would have guessed we came back to the knife store. I made it out somehow without getting another knife. A few were very tempting, but Ryan was not so lucky. He got another knife. What'd you get? The stun gun wasn't enough. I had to get something to, to show off. Oh yeah. I got this very nice Boker USB. Hit him with it. Oh. Very easy to deploy, very quick. Nice little OTF, dude. Yeah. I saw those. I liked it in the orange as well. Mm -hmm. Nissan Laurel. Mm -hmm. I bought it in Hiroshima, Japan with an agent. Oh, I put it to Japan and then shipped it over to We are out here at the show and we have finally made it. Snuck a wristband, zip tighter. We're gonna see if we can get in. Shout out to John and Kylie. Yeah, we're at the lot. Everything is still packed. I'm glad I rolled in a lot later today. I didn't have to deal with any lines or anything getting in. Apparently there's no lines inside either. We're gonna go see if we can find out and y'all come with me. We're gonna hit the outside lot first. I don't know if it's just parking out here or if this is part of the show. I think it's just parking, but we're gonna hit it first. There's always some bangers in the lot as well. We got a Mark III on some dinner plates, SSR Mark Ones. Good little car. And then we got Lozu. If you guys have not seen him on Instagram, you probably have seen him or in the local meet videos. Their show car like this, massive three-piece wheels, crazy kit, livery, crazy shit like this and then there's just stylish cars a step down it really just depends on what you want you know if you want a show car go for something go all out if you want a nice street car if you want something you can drive every day wheels tint coils you're gonna have a good car love seeing 326 cars because they're all fucking bent and they're all so clean all right like i said there's always some fucking bangers in the lot 33 gtst lm gts oh no those are gram lights those are gram lights Millennium Jade. Bro, does this color look familiar to y'all? This color look familiar? Hell yeah. Passat wagon on the bug wheels, dude. I love thick, full faces like this, especially on black cars. Super, super clean fucking wagon. This bike is stretched like a fucking foot. This thing's crazy. Every year we get more and more 34s, so I'm excited for them to actually all be legal and be here. Like I said, the goal is to have a matching 34 sedan one day or a 911. Technically both, but we're gonna get one of the other coming up next. Yo, know, kinda makes me miss mine. Kinda makes me miss mine.
gonna be it as far as the cinematics goes. I've gone through a battery and a half. My arms are fucking dead from holding the gimbal. So we're gonna walk around and see if we want some merch, some shit we can buy. It's always fun to grab a t-shirt or six, some stickers, some air fresheners. You never know what you're gonna find. I had to cop a Static Struggle tee. Huge shout out to Owen and Static Struggle for just always supporting me, supporting the channel. So I had to come see them and cop a t-shirt. They are based out of Pennsylvania. So any of you guys up north, you guys are needing some events, go check out Static Struggle. I will say, this year, there are so many more quality cars. Much more rear wheels, much more gone through. Just more quality shit this year. So they definitely stepped it up. Now, something that I heard is that they were denying people. And there is a catfish policy if your car is not what it looks like when you send in the pictures to apply. So, if, if they find something that's off, they can just kick you out of the show or not let you in. And then you're SOL, you don't get a refund. What I think happened this year is that they overbooked the shit out of the show. So I've seen a lot, a lot of clean cars. A lot of different people I've talked to that clearly should not have been kicked out of the show. If anybody knows what's been going on with that, let me know. So this Subaru right here, this light teal one, top three for me today in the show. This Tesla, I'm gonna say this is a top 10, a top five for me. You don't see them, you don't see them done on some fucking chrome Forgiatos, black roof wrap. I mean, this thing is just fucking sweet, but I would drive this any day of the week. Owen yeah. fucked up. Bro, what look happened? at that shit. Into a ditch. Fucking <laughs> epic toe Did game Did you get moment. stuck? Yes. Oh no, dude. A, a gladiator had to pull me out. I must have missed this earlier, but these all white emits, dude, are fucking icy. We've got a little bit of Sudani going on as well to fit these wide ass wheels. The white emits on the gold hardware. It's just fucking beautiful. Now this is top three cars of the show as well. Yellow R33, matching calipers. I don't know what wheels, man. They might be GMRs. Getting laid out, BN style kit, drag wing, paint matched. I mean, this thing is fucking insane. He's a North Carolina resident, bro. I did not know this. This thing is fucking gorgeous. Tucking in the rear. Look, bro, molded rear end. Some sort of wider fenders in the front. But this whole car is so fucking sick. This is my top three. Easy. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say almost first, bro. Tied for first. This super goes hard as fuck. And again, and it does not take much. Coils or bags, some nice wheels, and you are set. But dude, look at these fucking wheels. Floating center caps, bro. Unfucking beatable. I believe this is a Veilside RX-7. I don't know what color this is, but this purple lavender frost is gorgeous, dude. Look at this flake. Pink, purple, white. This thing could be it, dude. I love white wheels on a bright color car. Gold center cap, silver hardware, and whatever this color is, dude. All of this together, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say this is the hardest one here. So the new 8.6s are coming out fucking hard. Wide Meister S1s, gorgeous paint or wrap. He's got the low glow kit, you have to. It's just gorgeous, dude, they're coming out. This RCF on some giant rotiforms. They look like the 326 wheels. They look like whatever the Desmond um, five stars are. Still hard as fuck. We are gonna take a lap around the parking lot because there's always hard shit in the parking lot. So let's go see what we can find. Somebody getting a ticket or something? I don't know, I'm gonna leave them alone. This might not be y'all's favorite, but I kind of like this. I like this color on the white aero discs. I don't really like the triangle thing, the half and half, but the car as a whole, I like it. Oh, I don't care how many times I have to tell you guys, I am a whore for R35s. He's got some meat, he's bagged on some CCWs. I don't know what else you would want, dude. This is the pinnacle. This is it, man. Poor fucking Chino, dude. I don't know if he knows it yet, but I guess he cracked an oil pan or, or transmission or something, but, oh, dude. Nice little green Miat. I don't think y'all have seen this since it's been this color, but get it out on the gram lights. Hard top, mirror tint, this thing came out really good. So Ryan and I were cruising home, stumbled across a couple people. So we got Owen, Grayson, we stumbled on some fucking heat, bro. So first up, we got Alex's, I think it's a Cresta, a Chaser, I don't I don't know, but I followed him for a minute. You guys have seen this at the pre-meets and all the other meets as well. We got Kyle's 240, which he's had for like eight fucking years. If anybody who is interested in a 240, it's going up for sale after Gatlinburg, but let me show you guys this car. You got the drop top laid out, negative like, I'm gonna guess like 15, bro, maybe more. 15, 20 in the front, tucking in the rear, hard as fuck, dude. For a stance car, dude, to have everything gone through, interior, 
hopefully audio, but the rest of the car looks great. Freshly painted, clears, tucking on some, do you remember what tri-spokes these are? A7, uh, mm, like SA37s, SA thank you, SA yeah, but, SA37s, hard as fuck in the drop top. Man just had to raise his car to put air in it. I'm not that about it. E30, gray on gray, on the Equip tri-spokes, dude. I'm telling you. Like I said, Ryan and I were just on the way back to the house. We saw these cars and had to pull over. We got this fucking Wago van. Y'all have probably seen him on Instagram, Fear Dying guy. All these are hard as fuck. And then we got the white on white S15 with the white underglow. I have seen this thing driving around and not see it close up in person yet, but it is so fucking nice. We're at mini golf. Yeah, if you guys can see behind me, we're going up a we're going up a cliff. A cliff. <laughs> Insane. We're playing we're playing fucking mini golf right now. You have to come up this goddamn mountain to get up here. Look at this shit. Hold on. Look at this shit. You li it literally takes you all the way the fuck up this mountain. That's what we're doing. Selfie. Ah. <laughs> Okay. All right, so it is the end of the last night, Sunday night. Ryan and I just went out and cruised for Probably like an hour, actually. Ryan got some dinner, we got Taco Bell earlier. I'm fucking exhausted, but it's been an awesome, awesome weekend. Super happy I got to stay at the house. It made things a lot easier and more fun as well. Car did great. Obviously, we still have to drive home tomorrow, but there shouldn't be any issues. It's done great literally all weekend. I'm getting ready to go downstairs, pack, and go to sleep. So that's going to be it. If you guys have not watched the rest of the Gatlinburg videos, be sure to go check those out. Also, also a reminder, I will be starting to stream in the evenings, anytime starting at 8 or 9 and going to whenever. So be sure to come check me out. Check me out on Instagram and TikTok if you so please. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. And I just wanted to say to anybody and everybody that walked up and said hello, <clears throat> said hello, introduce yourself. Did you say hello? Hello, <laughs> bro, I'm so exhausted. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you guys for real. All y'all being here, I had more people say they watched the YouTube videos than anything else, which means the absolute world. So hopefully you guys have seen yourselves in these videos and from the bottom of my heart, thank you. I'll see you in the next one.